Hey guys, what's going on? Greenville Gear. Um, back with another break for you. Um, I'm going to do some 2019 Gypsy Queen, as you see here. These are two blaster boxes I got online, cheap. Um, so I, I really had a lot of fun breaking this product, and um, I found myself doing something I haven't done in um, 20 years, and that is building a set. I started to realize I had a lot of Gypsy Queen base cards from breaking a hobby box, and and then from a few blasters and so anyway i started to organize them yesterday it was a lot of fun so i'm kind of looking in, in some ways to just make sure i've got a lot enough base cards to to do that um but i also really like of course the autos out of here they're on card um some of my buy on um you know ebay or something like that um as singles um i'll show you here's one i had got you know you can get these cheap online um, they're on card. They're really nice. And so, um, I've done that, but, um, so those would be cool. I also like the numbered cards in here. They do the extra pack, um, of the parallel cards. I think they're green. Um, so we'll do those. Um, I guess we might as well just do both boxes now. And, uh, just having a lot of fun doing these and trying to do a video every week maybe six days something like that so i want to thank everybody for supporting the channel and watching the videos and giving a like and all that stuff i don't know how youtube works exactly i'm new to this but apparently all the engagement works so if you watch a video and like it like the video that would be cool uh, of course you can subscribe um, down here um, and that would be cool too um, so here's the two blaster boxes worth of uh, 2019 gypsy queen okay, why don't we do this we'll put this in the background so there's that um so we can see that so let's do these let's do these green packs first i think these are green um there's cool numbered cards in this set i have opened a ton of this and i have yet to find a bazooka back which is another rare i've had a few logo swaps and yeah here's the green one so there's harrison bader blackman nicholas santana and gahoon so nothing too exciting but as i'm building my set i'm kind of setting aside the green cards and so i'll have a bunch of parallels in there too i'll just put them in the box or something i don't know richards sheffield ozart and reddick and just to make sure yeah none of these are numbered or none of them have a bazooka back or anything like that um i feel like out of the hobby boxes you can get some nice parallels with some numbers and stuff so we'll get into these here um see what we get um, so again, we're looking for the, the logo swaps, right? So if this is the Gypsy Queen logo, then that's a logo swap. Um, some of them had a blank, um, nameplate as well, which is kind of different. So nice base pack there. Also, I got to thank people that are like supporting the channel, STP Card Collector, Thomas's Baseball Card Collection. Um, another channel you should definitely follow um, is Swing Away Sports Cards. Nice guy. Um, he's doing cool videos, and he recommended my channel, and I thought that was really cool. So he's kind of getting back into the hobby like me. Um, so there we go. I suspect the Altuve cards are not commanding a huge audience right now. Um, probably a good time to buy those if you're an Altuve fan. Walker Herrera. I like these fortune teller cards. There's Chris Davis. I think I've got a bunch of those. I don't I don't have anything near the full set. Thomas. Yep. And I forgot to check actually for bazooka backs or anything like that on these bags. Again, this has been my white whale, you guys. So if we if we find one of these. Like uh, I don't know why. I've opened a ton of Gypsy Queen. I just haven't had any. There's Robles. Nice. Martinez, Nix, Albies. See? Just get used to that. Like, is Greenville Gear ever going to find one of these bazooka backs? And... Probably not. Ty Cobb, that's a nice one. So, what's cool about these is, you probably know this if you follow this set, but anything over the 300, I think, are the short prints, I think. And you can put it in the comments if I'm wrong about that or I, I need to know a little bit more about that but i think it's 300 to 320 or short prints and i don't think i have cob which is kind of cool so th that's going to be kind of partly the toughest part of the set um so 
Actually, I'm going to set Ty aside as I do my organizing um, when I finish this video. So, there's Yadier Molina. There's Mike Trout. Um, card number one. That's good for the set. Cool. Like, why couldn't I get, you know, Mike Trout bazooka back or logo swap anyway actually i don't think i had i'm thankful grateful to get the trout because i don't think i had it there's ben attendee panic aaron judge oh cool these are so cool these are the tarot of the diamond set and i have maybe um half of these i think there's like 20 in the set i just think these are cool so i've been putting these in a top loader and i'm just gonna put them in my box with so i'll put him over with uh, ty cobb those are reddick and nothing exciting there. Oh, I wanted to do this too when I do breaks. I see people have these, right? The little acrylic holder. So we'll see what's what's um, holder holder worthy. I know that this card is not, but it's just actually it's not going to fit there. So we'll definitely not do that. All right. So I like those tarot of the diamonds and the fortune tellers are cool too. That's all right, so blaster number two. All base cards, which, as I mentioned, is fine with me because I am building a set. And I gotta tell you, it's been like therapeutic and relaxing to just sit and like organize my packs of Gypsy Queen into zero to 100, you know, 100 to 200 and so on. Ryan Braun, Doolittle, Haley Dean. It's like in this day and age, we need relaxing activities and sorting cards is relaxing for me anyway there's another fortune teller I think I've got Scherzer but that's a nice one so who knows if there's any good stuff in the blasters I suspect not I mean we haven't found a single we found one short print so far one tarot with a diamond Nola there's Chris Bryant Hoskins, Shaw, Mullins, but our short prints and our variations are few and far between, I think, in the blasters. I mean, that's partly why I was able to get these cheap. Um, Glacius Price, Diaz, nice, there's a blue. So those are, those are parallels. That should be, yeah, that's numbered. Cool. So here I am saying that we're not going to get anything good out of these blasters, and then what do we get? We get a blue to 250. Very cool. That's nice. Ken Giles, we'll put him up on our on our stand. So Giles makes the stand. Cool. Jacoby Jones. Cool. Um, two packs left. So that's cool. I've gotten a few of the blues. I bought one red one online. Those are numbered to. Oh gosh, I don't know. Maybe ten. I bought one of those for cheap, just because I thought that was kind of cool. Kopech. Santana, so I'll base there. And last pack of the break. Um, Hunter Dozier, Hugh Darvish, Sheffield. There's a Tarot of the Diamond, Xander. That's nice. Cool, so two of those uh, break. And then Matt Carpenter, so just a Sheffield. I think we pulled a couple Sheffields in this break, so... So that's the break. So there's a nice stack of cards to go into my set building. I'll organize those now. We got the blue to 250 Ken Giles. That's kind of nice. We got, just to recap, two Tarot's of the Diamond, which are cool. Giancarlo Stanton and Xander Bogarts. We got the Ty Cobb short print playing golf. Really cool. And last but not least, a couple of uh, fortune teller inserts. So basically working out to be... Uh, one per blaster so that's cool anyway thanks again for watching the channel really appreciate the support and um, again follow those other guys stp card collector thomas's baseball card collection collector yeah thomas's baseball card collection and and then swing away sports cards follow those i'm going to try to always give other channels a shout out and people that i'm following and watching and stuff because it's just really fun to to be a part of the community and um, um, i get a lot of um, pleasure watching those other videos of breaks and, and what other people are up to. So thanks again, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.